Okay guys, so it is the 26th of the of September and we've got our lovely new teaser thing for Age of Calamity. Oh my god. Oh god, that was quite loud. Um, <laughs> so excited, man. I am so excited I'm hitting my desk. This came out 50 minutes ago, so I'm, I, I'm still quite- I'm actually quite early to this. Let's do this, guys. Let's do this. Ah, <gasps> Cal Citadel. Dance of crying. Ooh. Well, Mifa! You've grown since I last saw you. And yet, you have not changed. Mifa Bay. I would like to be fully Baby Sidon! Learning new ways to fight the foes might do you some good. So that's why it's gonna be us! Well, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. We got the uh, the face of the, the Sheikah. Now I noticed with the last trailer that this Sheikah that goes around with Lincoln Zelda has a hat. Like, yeah, yeah, it's, it's a hat. This this bit, this hat. And I noticed on the hat that it's got the uh, the dangly bits, the dangly ornaments on it that Impa has in Breath of the Wild. So I recognize that is Impa. That that's that's got to be Impa. Rudani is always in a difficult spot. You get to fight it. I Igniotas? Ooh. Arabosa. No longer, I say. I will pilot this divine beast. So this is them actually being told to pilot the divine beast. Little bird. Meadow. Get the ravioli. <gasps> ravioli. Rito Village is my home. While I'm here, you won't be getting any closer. You didn't stand a chance. Damn. The time has finally come to reveal Far Meadow's divine power. Ooh. <gasps> Great Deku tree. You have all that is. Oh, they're all there. The nice. <gasps> Naboris, Guardians, <gasps> Great Calamity! Oh, oh, oh! Hey, 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 wait, wait, where's my ass? As you can see, these, this, um, this Sheikah's got the ornaments on the hat. I reckon that is Impa because those are the exact same ornaments that Impa has on her hat in Breath of the Wild. That, my friend, is Impa. Face facts. <laughs> okay, let's go. Ooh. Awesome! Oh, guys! Oh, I'm so excited for this! So excited! Lucky they do. I I've pre-ordered on the Nintendo store, so I'm getting that lucky ladle. In game, I am training sword. Nice, guys! I'm so so excited for this. Let's do let's do a little uh, recap. Let's see if I notice anything. So this is obviously a cow outside out. The tower is there, surprisingly. Like I wasn't. Eh, yeah, of course the tower would be there because this is the Great Calamity. So obviously the tower would have been up because Shika Technology has already been founded by then. So we got that. We got a guardian down here. Oh, a malfunctioning guardian. Hang on. Let's just try and see. I don't know what this here is. Um, got lots of like explosions, I think, or unless it's malice. We got these little specks in the in the sky. So I'm just wondering if it's blood moon, or if it's just ash. Boom. Mifa. You've grown since I last saw you. He does not look happy. And yet, you have not changed. She sounds different. I don't know why. Be fully prepared. 
Baby Cylon! So we got Dorif in there. Um, I wonder if he's killed the uh, the Guardian yet. I mean, he's got the scars on the on his head, so I'm guessing he has killed the Guardian. Because apparently in Breath of Wild lore, Dorifan protects Zora's domain by um, killing a, a, a Guardian. And in doing so, he gets these scars on his head. So I'm guessing that this is after the, the Guardians attack Zora's domain? Which is interesting, and we've got the elder guy there that didn't approve of Link in Breath of the Wild, I think? I don't know who this is. Oh, I see we've got Zelda and Mifa. So this is obviously the corruption of the Divine Beasts. Right, we always see in uh, Gorn City here. Yeah, you can obviously see that these guys haven't been chosen. Oh, they've only just been chosen to be the pilots because they don't have the heroes' um, tunics and stuff. Yeah, because obviously he's he would have had it over his shoulder. If I remember correctly, so he's finding a load of the Zalfos. There's more than the Zalfos at the back. This is definitely Death Mountain because of all the lava and stuff. So we've got an, an Igneo Talus. Oh, was that the wrong time? So we've got an Igneo Talus. So, oh, so I'm guessing that those are going to be like bosses in the game. So you get to fight the, like the world bosses. So that's going to be like. Well, we've already seen a Hinox. We've already seen a Lionel. And this. I think this is all the the, the uh, world bosses in Breath of the Wild, unless I'm forgetting some. Uh, so we've got Igneo Talus here. And before we go on, I've actually noticed that this is what we do with um, Unibo in Breath of the Wild, and that's breaking down um, Elden Bridge. So, Daruk was actually doing that in Age of Calamity, so I thought that was a quite a cool touch. So, he's breaking down Elden Bridge, which which is what we do with Unibo in Breath of the Wild. So, that's just something I've noticed while I'm editing. Okay, continue. Yeah, this is the corruption of Urdania. So we got Urbosa now. No longer. No longer. Oh my god, we get to see this little guy. I don't I'm seeing him with the, the other two. Oh he is there. You can see you can see him like beside Zelda with um Daruk and with I don't think you get to see him with Mifa. You get to see this little guy, you're like, oh my god, he's so cute. And even at this point, um, Link hasn't been, or I'm guessing he's been chosen as um, champion at this point, but he hasn't got his tunic yet. I definitely think this is Zimpa. Oh my god, Rudania right here. So Rudania, so they're, they're right beside Rud, not Rudania, or <laughs> Naboris, sorry. So yeah, we've got Naboris right here. Yeah, you will. So she's fighting those alphas as well. There are a lot of those alphas, apparently. So here we get to see some uh, Gerudo warriors, and we got Impa. I'm, I'm just gonna call her Impa. We got Impa here. Uh, and three there. I think that's a statue. This. I don't know whether this is um, Gerudo Town. This, this looks more like uh, the Yiga base. I don't know why. I just it just clicks to me at, at, with it being the Yiga clan base. I hope you're not hurt, little bird. Little bird. Corruption of Naboris, and now we got corruption of uh, Meadow. Rito Village is my home. Yeah, Ravioli. There's Alphos again! <laughs> the time has so he's on Meadow there. Power. Yeah! So we've got the champions here. We've got uh, Link, Zelda, and the little guy. Oh my god, he's so cute. And we've got the Great Deku Tree. And we've got some, some knights here as well. And they look like Hyrulean knights. So obviously this is in the Korok Forest. Because that's where the Master Sword gets put, 
and obviously the great Deku Tree. You have all that is it's funny because in this shot, the night, the high really Hyrulean knights have have disappeared. Ah, you do get to see him. There he is, right down there. That's, that's probably the closest I'm gonna get. That's a little guardian down there. I want I really hope that we get to play. That would be awesome. You have all that is needed to face whatever destiny awaits. I rose faith. Is in your hand. So we got Naboris here. Oh, there is a lot of guardians down there. Christ. Now that looks like... Would that be Spectacle Rock? That looks like Spectacle Rock. Because that's... The tower's there. Yeah. It doesn't, doesn't look like... What's this? This is interesting. I've seen the shot. Let's see how much I can, can point out. If that's Spectacle Rock, then this is probably the Great Plateau. Well, what's this place? This looks like Hyrule Castle Town, but it's kind of in the wrong place, if it is. So I'm a little bit confused. And the forest is, looks like from where we're looking in this, in the shot, it looks like the forest. Oh, we got our boats out there as well. And uh, the forest looks like it's on Death Mountain. So many guardians. A lot of fire. I'm really confused about what this place is. I don't think it's Hyrule Castle. I don't think it's Hyrule Castle. Um, just because, oh, uh, Castle Town, sorry. Because Hyrule Castle would be there as well. So I don't think this is Hyrule Castle and Castle Town. Um, I'm just trying to wonder where else it would be. I'm just trying to, like, picture the whole of Hyrule in Breath of the Wild and trying to picture where, what that place would be. Yeah, this isn't Castle Town. I really don't think it is. Um, but that's Spectacle Rock, definitely. Well, I wouldn't say definitely, but it's it's got these two bits here, which kind of and the and the bit in between, the bridge in between. So I would say that that is Spectacle Rock. So that's the Gerudo um, Sheikah Tower, and it's kind of hard to tell, but this does look like, or kind of looks like the Great Plateau. Which is why I'm so confused. This isn't Gerudo because you can see grass. This isn't the Gerudo Desert. And you can see like paths and stuff. So yeah. I wouldn't say it's Gerudo Desert. Yeah. I'm just. I'm struggling to place this. I don't know what's going on over here. It's like, like, like a bit of a glitch. But. <laughs> we will ignore that. There's so many guardians. Oh, I hope we don't have to fight that many guardians in, in the game. Alright. I like how it bursts though. So we've got a lot, a lot of guardians. This this definitely looks like Castle Town. So we've got one of the, the flying... Is that, is it, are they called Sky Wardens? I can't remember what they're called. <laughs> and then we've also got the, uh, the other gu the, the main guardians as well. I really hope that... Gr Ganon doesn't corrupt the, the little guardian that goes around with us. Because that would just be heartbreaking. Like, <laughs> I so hope. Oh, big explosion. What would that explosion be? Where are they? There's a waterfall behind them, so that... The place, obviously, with the most waterfalls is Zora's Domain. And the other place that... I can think of is the the rainforest. I forgot what it's called. I apologize. Um, it's the rainforest down in the southeast because that has waterfalls as well. Don't know if Zelda and Link went there on their travels. Yeah, this is def. This has got to be Impa. It's got to be Impa. So Zelda's still got the the Sheikah Slate at this point. I need to see it. I don't Zelda or oh, elderly Zelda. See if she's got the same eye color. Let's just look at see see if Zelda has that eye color. It's kind of got a black eye color. The eye color doesn't match. But I do think that this is Impa. This has got to be Impa. Not unless this ornamental hat decoration is just like a typical Sheikah thing. 
Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Let's continue. I just want, oh wait, we've got another waterfall here. And we got this like, um, fort here. So I'm just wondering, I'm trying to think of where a fort would be with a waterfall behind it. That wouldn't be Hateno. Because Hateno doesn't have a waterfall. It's just trying to picture where all these scenes are taking place. Like, it's really difficult. I mean, the world of Breath of the Wild is so, so big. Like, it's so big. <laughs> oh, he's just... Oh, he's got the Master Sword at this point. And, and the Hero's Tunic. So he's definitely... Or well, the Champion's Tunic. Um, so yeah, he's definitely got... Been chosen as the Champion at this point. So this is probably at the brink of the Great Calamity where... Ganon goes a bit nuts. So this explosion is possibly what's happening at Hyrule Castle where Ganon's taking over and doing his big roar thing in the sky. I can't picture where this is. Oh wait, this might be in Hyrule Castle because there's definitely waterfalls in Hyrule Castle and this looks like part of the wall that would be on the castle. So this might actually be a Hyrule Castle. Ah, okay. And obviously Ganon is in Hyrule Castle. Because he does this big roar thing in the sky. Uh, the pillars are up at this point. So we can definitely see that Hyrule Castle is not looking too good at this point. You can't see Castle Town. I think you can see, kind of see some of the buildings down here. Um, but other than that, you can't really see Castle Town. So you can't tell if it's destroyed or not. Uh, we got like a wall here. So maybe it's not been destroyed yet. And this is just as the start of the destruction. So, there are lots of like these flickery ash type things. So, again, it could be a blood moon, or it could just be that Castle Town is on fire. Um, so, we got this ray here, this ray of light. I wonder what that is. That might be a divine beast. I'm just wondering what this ray of light is. Maybe it's a, a shooting star. <laughs> Because we get them in Breath of the Wild. And then we've got Ganon just going bit his roar in the sky. Guys, I am so excited for this. November 20th. So excited. And I'm getting a lucky ladle. And a pot lid. Guys, we're getting a pot lid. <laughs> so yeah. Comment down below what you guys think of your theories. So I will be available in paid DLC at a later time if you have saved data from like a uh, breath. Oh, nice! So the training sword, like this item, maybe may become available as as paid DLC at a later time if you have saved data from. Like uh, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild on your Nintendo Switch system, you will, you can acquire the Trace Sword in-game bonus item. So pretty much if you've got Breath of the Wild, you're pretty much going to get the Training Sword. And a pot lid. Gotta get the pot lid. Is there anything else? It's the Nintendo logo. Guys, I am so excited for this. All right, so I'm gonna leave it there guys. Please comment your theories down below because I'm so interested to hear what you guys think and just comment if I've messed anything up <laughs> You see, I, I hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, review thing and I will see you guys in the next one